everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new there, hello, my name is Delilah and I would love to have you subscribe to this channel and also hit that notification bell that way you don't miss out on any new videos that I post. For my channel, I wanted to start a new series called Telly to Belly where I show you foods that are inspired by movies, uh, TV shows, cartoons, and in today's video, we're gonna be making something Willy Wonka thing, which is blueberry pie and ice cream. So let's get started. So for this Willy Wonka theme, I wanted to make the blueberry pie from the three course gum meal. Of course, I'm not gonna be making gum because uh, I don't have ingredients for that, but we could do a little bit of a play off of that and make an actual blueberry pie. So the ingredients that you are going to need, flour, cold water, sugar and salt, which I have them both here, butter, and shortening. Starting off, we are going to make the pie dough, so I'm just going to mix the dry ingredients, which is the sugar and the salt, and mix that up with my flour. So now we're just going to mix in our butter and our shortening, and for my butter, I always like to use a grater instead of a pastry cutter. It just makes it easier to mix and already puts it into chunks. When making pie dough, you always want to have your shortening and your butter cold. Um, so here I'm just going to add both of those ingredients and uh, grate in my butter and with the shortening I just go ahead and throw some flour on there so it's not too sticky and then I just crumble that up. Then just go ahead and grate up your butter. And once all your butter has been grated, just go ahead and kind of break it up a little bit and start using your best tools, which is your hands, and start mixing that all up with the flour and the shortening until you get coarse uh, crumbs that are about pea size. Once you have that achieved, this is how the mixture should look like. Very nice, flaky, uh, crumbly. And from here, you're just gonna go ahead and start adding your half a cup of water. Start off slow, I added about half of the water and then from there I just um, added little by little until it all came together. And right now your dough is not going to be fully incorporated and mixed so you just want to get it to be not so sticky so you're just going to turn it out on your counter or table whatever you're using and need a little bit of flour in there so with the flour you just want to add little by little as well until it is no longer sticking to your hands or the table So once your pie dough is no longer sticking to your hands or the table, go ahead and wrap this in plastic wrap and you can leave it in the fridge for 30 minutes or overnight. Mine, I'm just going to leave it in there for about 30 minutes while we prepare our filling. So while our dough is chilling, now we're just gonna go ahead and start making our blueberry filling. And the ingredients for this that you'll need are blueberries, cinnamon, cornstarch, and sugar, which I have it all mixed up in here. And then you're gonna need your lemon juice. 
So this footage got cut out, but all I did was mixed all the ingredients together until it was all well combined. And that's it. That's how easy it is to make this blueberry filling. So now we just pulled out our pie dough out of the fridge. It chilled for about 30 minutes. So now we're just going to take this and cut it in half, which I forgot my knife. I'll be right back. So now we're gonna need this, half of this for the top and then the other half for the bottom. Now you just wanna knead it because the shape that you start with is what you end up with. So from here, you'll just go ahead and add some flour down on your board. Also go ahead and add some flour onto your rolling pin so it doesn't get stuck. Roll it out, do a quarter turn, then roll again, another quarter turn. By doing it this way, you'll get a perfect circle and if your dough starts sticking to the table, you'll just go ahead and add some more flour down and just continue rolling and turning your dough a quarter turn. Okay, now that you have your dough all rolled out, I have mine down to an eighth of an inch or so. You're gonna grab your pie tin. And the easiest way that I find to get it onto there is I fold it in half and then you'll fold it again. And from here, get your pie dough, start the point out in the middle, and then just go ahead and start unfolding your dough. And you want to slightly push it into your tin. And after that is all pushed in, you wanna cut off the excess, which I'm taking my butter knife and doing so. And now, just take your filling that you have mixed up and start adding this into your pie. All right, now I'm just gonna put this in the fridge while I do my lattice top. You can do a crumble top or you could do just a plain pie dough crust on top, but I'm gonna do a lattice one, so we're gonna stick this in the fridge. So to do my lattice top, I'm gonna go ahead and take a piece of parchment paper and the second half of my pie dough, and I'm just going to mix in what was left over for the bottom crust and mix that all together. Before I put it onto my parchment paper, I'm gonna roll this out first. And then we can go ahead and cut out our strips onto our parchment paper. All right, so now that this is rolled out, I'm gonna go ahead and place it onto my parchment paper. And bring it over. This is also about an eighth of, of an inch of thickness. And from here, you just wanna cut out your strips. Now that we have the lattice cut out, I'm gonna bring out my pie and we're gonna, I'll show you guys how to set this on top. So I'm just going to take my biggest strip and place this down in the middle. I think it might be a little too thick. So I'm just gonna cut it a little more. And place it starting off in the middle. And then you'll take your next strip and place that down and so on and so forth. Once 
once you have that down, now you're gonna go the opposite way. So before you set your middle one down, you're going to flip these two, leaving two in the middle down. And then you'll place your strip. And place those over. And with your next one, you're going to flip the two that were laying down and turn those over. And you're just gonna repeat that with the whole lattice top. Before egg washing our pie, um, I always, when doing a pie like this, sometimes you will have it drip a little bit, so I just like to place it on a baking pan with some foil. But once you do that, you can go ahead and make your egg wash, which is one egg and two tablespoons of water. And you just wanna brush the top of your crust. Now we're just gonna bake this at 400 degrees for about 45 to 50 minutes. Be sure to be checking it. You'll know when it's ready when your fruit starts to bubble. And here it is, all done baking my blueberry pie and I'm just gonna pair it with some regular vanilla ice cream. You can add any type of ice cream that you would like. And now I'm just gonna cut and plate a piece. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Also give this video a like and share it with your family and friends and I'll see you guys in my next Telly to Belly.